Jeff. Thanks, Andrea. Certainly what it is all about. And every child is a champion here at Nationwide Children's Hospital. And let's bring up our first family here because it's time to hang some medals. Right, Corinne? Yeah. All right. We're going to give some medals away here. The, another children's champion medal ceremony. We have the uh, Crawford family from Prospect. Yep. Mm -hmm. okay. Names? Um, this is Joey Crawford. He's actually a children's champion. Um, I'm his mom, and this is his brother, Jackson, and his brother, Lucas, and that's his dad. Beautiful family. Tell me a little bit of the story about Josh. Um, it's um, actually Joey. Or he Joey, he was born with um, a small hole in his heart that we discovered when he was nine months old, and uh, we had to get it monitored yearly, and they were hoping that it would close, and actually last October, um, when he had his annual checkup, they realized that he had a valve that was leaking and the hole was actually larger than they thought, so he had to have open heart surgery last November. He looks like he is doing great. Let's have a medal for Joey, and we appreciate that. I didn't mean to call you Josh there, partner. Okay. All right. Thank you guys very much. We do appreciate it. Doing good, buddy. Looking good there. Let's bring up the uh, Fromm family from Baltimore. And this is Mark Fromm right down here in front. Hi. Can you tell me a little bit about Mark's story? Yes. Mark was born with a congenital heart defect. Um, it was discovered when he was five days old. Um, he's gone. There he goes. He is gone. He's yeah. gone through, <laughs> through three open heart surgeries, and he is uh, doing, doing really well. well he looks great. He, no worse for the wear there. Hey, Corinne, do you think he'll sit still for one second? You put a medal on him? That'd be awesome. What do you think about that, Mark? Yeah, cool. Good man, just freelancing a little bit. It's what we do here. Thank you all very much. Appreciate it. Have a great day. Let's bring up the Miller family here. And Brianna is right there in front. All from Lima, right? We have Alexis, Brianna, and Kayla Miller. Tell me about this beautiful family here. Well, these are the triplets. They're the ABC triplets. They were born at 24 weeks, just weighing a little over a pound. Um, Brianna has severe cerebral palsy. Um, she's ventilator dependent at night, and she's been through 18 surgeries so far. Um, Kayla's been through one, and Alexis here has autism and ADHD, and she's been through four surgeries. Um, if it wasn't for Children's Hospital, they wouldn't even be here. Well, that's uh, certainly something that uh, a lot of families can say here. And we've got medals because uh, every child is a champion here at Nationwide Children's Hospital. And why don't you hand that to Mom, Corinne? And uh, I think, we, don't we? Oh, yeah, let's put it on her. Awesome. Awesome. Looking good. And for the other young ladies as well. Good job. Once again, Alexis, Brianna, and Kayla Miller. And we thank you guys for coming out today. Appreciate it very much. <laughs> Champions Children's here. All right. The Sobolski family. Jennifer making her way up here. <laughs> little cutie pie. With the toe head blonde. I can relate to that. Yeah. Uh, tell me a little bit about your story. Uh, about six months, Jennifer was diagnosed with atrial septal defect, um, a condition in her heart. And at about a year and a half, Dr. Cheatham uh, went in and closed that hole. So she's been growing and thriving great ever since then. How old now? How old? How old? Six. Six years of age. All right. Well, Jennifer, you get a medal. It'll match uh, your outfit right there. It's perfect. Looking awesome. Good looking family. Thank you guys so much. Appreciate it. This guy's a spitting image of me when I was a kid. You want a little look into what Jeff Hogan looked like when he was a kid? Right there, buddy boy. Thank you very much. All right, come on out here. Jessica Tillery from Gehanna. Jessica, good to have you here this morning. How are you? Good. How are you? Doing okay. I'm doing good. Tell me your story. Um, about four years ago, I was admitted into the emergency room with a dissecting aortic aneurysm. This is really rare in kids, and so my surgery was really risky. I had a 12-hour open-heart surgery, and it went well. And I'm so thankful to Children's Hospital for saving my life. All right. How long ago was that again? Four years. Okay. So four years, thriving, doing everything normal now? Yep. I had another surgery last August, but it's all good now. Okay. Very good. Another champion. That's outstanding. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. And you apparently have, what, one medal left? Oh, two medals left? Let me hold one of these for just one second because uh, our our junior uh, host here, uh, Corinne Lord, um, needs to get one of these medals. So I'm going to turn the tables on her just a little bit and ask you to tell us your story. I know we, we heard it earlier, but for the folks maybe just tuning in. Um, I was diagnosed with leukemia on my sixth birthday, so it wasn't a very awesome birthday. And um, I came straight to Children's Hospital, and they've been taking great care of me, and I've 
made it through and I'm cancer free and um, I'm coming back every other month now for checkups. Okay, from your sixth birthday and you're how old now? Ten. And you're a junior host on top of it all. Yeah. Enjoying that. You can leave that one right there because we're going to put this one on you. And I'm sorry to say that we're going to have another junior host coming in because I've enjoyed the time with you here today. Thank you very much. All right, Jesse is one of those miracles that received some fabulous service treatment here at Nationwide. And you're going to help me with a special medal for another little champion. Let me introduce this beautiful family to you. We want to bring up Bren Lee Lane and her family from Chillicothe. Hi, Mom. Introduce yourself and tell us a little bit about your story, if you will. I'm Jessica, and this is Brenly. I, I was diagnosed um, at 19 weeks pregnant. Brenly had um, hypoplastic left heart, which is a congenital heart disease. Um, she had a, a pretty low chance of survival, and we come here to Children's, and so far she's been through two open hearts, and we're still going. <laughs> oh, and she's beautiful. You would never know that she's been through the trauma that she has, but what does this mean to you when you come into this place? Oh, wow. I mean, this, it's it's a good feeling just coming in here and and knowing that this I'm so glad we made the choice to come here. Your other daughter is uh, Ariana. All yeah. right, Jets, come on, let's give the little one a medal, and we'll make sure that we get a medal for her sister as well. Thank you. Oh, lovely, you are lovely. I saw how she grabbed that microphone. She's nipping at my heels. I can see my job. My days are numbered. <laughs> good. Thanks so much for sharing your story with us. We really appreciate. It. Beautiful family, aren't they? Thank you guys. Bye, sweetie. Bye. Oh, there's something else. 